If y'all ain't already know, we got the 150. Right now I'm doing modifications, got new mirrors on it. And we already got a full box full of stuff. Got 12 gram, got ignition stuff. Right now we got carburetor on. You already see that right there. We have a PWK, well, it's not a PWK, but a rolling wrench. I'll post it up here on the screen for y'all if y'all really want to. But it's a uh, limited edition Beta 150. Pretty sure you already seen it on the other side. I just like seeing it on this side because the tube and you can't even see it, ETR 150. But I'm about to put on the new CDR. It is gonna be killer. Got a full box full of stuff. CDR's right here. Putting this bad boy on. What y'all think about this? Comment down below, cause I'm trying to know if this actually does performance or not. Cause I'm finna be putting it on anyway. I'm gonna see y'all on the street. I might actually record on the street anyway. So right now we have the orange one on here. You can tell it looks definitely needing some new work. And we got the new one down here. Let's see if this does any performance for real. I'm about to do a road to horsepower series if y'all really want to. I'm about to be getting this thing on the road. Fastest 150, easy upgrades. All right, boys, we finna be starting it up. But hopefully the camera ain't really that bad because it's like right on my chest. So y'all should be able to get good views anyway. Let's see if it turned on. Straight pipe. Alright, let's get it. I think it's that CDI trying to kick in. It may not be good. If not, it's the spark plug. Cause it feels like a weak spark.
a think high RPM to fucking spark plug boot cuts off. It's just making too much power to even cut it. Called the damn gas tuner off. Damn back brake is shit. As soon as I give it, it's gone, son. like it this thing wants like a two hundred dollar exhaust man got the big down cut but once you do it this motherfucker does not slow down that's why I barely even give it cuz I'm sitting at 35 at quarter throttle definitely see y'all in a new video for real cuz this motherfucker is definitely gonna bring some more memories but let me know in the comments what y'all want to put on it because this thing already gets 75 and that's that's literally what's on it right now is 75 damn can I not get it focused for real I think it's because it's shady as hell there you go 75 yeah I'll kept it about right here plus we might be installing this most definitely i just don't know where to put it because like i want to put it right here because you know it'd be really easy to tell when you're looking down from it but i mean it's going to get covered up from it and then i wanted it also right there i just don't know where to go because I guess one of y'all let me know. I'm gonna probably do one of the subscribers suggestion if y'all ever want. I might wind up putting it just right there. For real. But it's just gonna be hard trying to line it all the way through. There's just no way you're gonna be able to line it through all the way. But I'm gonna go get it done and then I'm gonna show y'all what I did to it. So, definitely see y'all. If y'all ever wondered where the 50cc went, here it is right here, cause like this thing, 
I mean, it's not really broken. I'm going to show y'all what's wrong with it. Look at the stance. If y'all don't know anything about mopeds, like... I had to put a 150cc shock on it because of this. The frame is literally bent. If you can tell, that does not look normal. Wheel straight goes up right here. That's supposed to be right here. <laughs> it's supposed to be right here. And yeah. The exhaust is at the bottom and here's the 150 exhaust if y'all didn't see in the video but if y'all want to see the 50 cc back up and running because it's still got upgraded carb it's got everything on it besides broken tubes from the crash i'm gonna put it up right here this is what it looked like after the crash and if y'all want to see some more videos over to 50cc, most definitely hit the thumbs up and subscribe. I'm going to be out there with y'all. Hit me up with any groups with moped, shit, scooters. We out there. Definitely going to get all my friends out. And if you live in the KY area, mostly Madisonville, Princeton, Owensboro, Evansville, Nashville... Most definitely, I want to go to Nashville so bad. I'm going to be there. I'm going to hit y'all up later. See y'all.